All right, hello everyone. I just wanted to talk today about registers of the harp and how that affects our posture on the harp. It's something that's just good to be aware of if you're writing for the harp to know what we need to do to be able to play in different registers and how that it can affect jumping between registers. So our neutral position on the harp is gonna be when we're playing kind of in the middle range of the harp. So kind of around middle C, an octave above, an octave below. This is because we are able to balance the harp just with our back, sitting normally. We don't have to do any kind of adjustment to keep the harp in balance. Now, when we're playing at the very top register of the harp, notice the change in position from here. I'm actually having to move my upper shoulder back. So that means now I can only balance the harp by my knee. So my knee is balancing the harp rather than it being both my shoulder and my knee. So that requires a change in position to go from here back to the middle. Now it's a jump that we can certainly make, but it's just good to be aware of that. Now, if I go to the bottom range of the harp, notice what happens. I go from middle range. If I'm going to the bottom, this is the very bottom of the harp, notice how I'm having to hunch forward. So now when I'm changing my position, my knee is no longer able to contact the harp. So I'm having to completely balance the harp with my shoulder as I'm playing in this low register of the harp. So there's a difference in body position as we're jumping. So that means that really quick jumps around the harp is a little bit difficult unless you're balancing in another way. So if you're going from the bottom to the top, having to kind of compensate with my body to be able to keep the harp in balance. Now that's not to say you can never do it, it's just something to be aware of. So I want to highlight the section from the WC dances that we all love. The so the reason it's a little bit tricky, um, there's multiple reasons, but one of the reasons it's tricky is because we're having to shift down to different positions. Now it's a little bit mitigated because we are going one position to the next to the next rather than jumping back and forth. But watch how my body position changes as I go through this section. I can do that better. So you notice I started sitting up straight and started leaning forward just to be able to keep the harp in balance. So. Think about register of the harp when you're writing. When you're writing in the middle register, that's kind of our neutral position. That's where you should default to and then build the extremities from there.